is amazing. It can captivate people's minds and hearts and it can be a life-changing experience. Instructing young music teachers, the great Russian composer Dmitry Shostakovich told them, you should love and study the great art of music. It will open for you a world of new ideas, deep feelings and emotions. It will purify you, make you spiritually richer and more accomplished. Life will appear to you much more colorful than before. Music is one of the most sophisticated forms of art, if not the most sophisticated. However, we strongly believe that anybody can learn it if the right approach is taken and a proper foundation is provided. wonderful specialist music schools in this country, but they're highly selective and limited mostly to children who already at a very early age know that they want to make music their profession. Anybody wanting to learn music deserves the best teaching, no matter whether or not they will choose music as a profession. offer a comprehensive program of music studies. This program includes two instrumental lessons a week for the first instrument and also salfeggio, choir training, composition, chamber music, music history. the same time. I guess it sounds a bit like a person in really big depression. <laughs> <laughs> One of the strengths of the Russian musical tradition is equipping every child with excellent technique which will allow them to express their feelings and emotions. starts from the very first days when we shape our pupils' hands as if they were made from plasticine. Just relax your hand. All fingers are very soft mm. and relaxed. Don't try to help me because I can feel it. That's an angry cat. So we are relaxed cats. Perfect. Oh. 
That's good. That's really, really good. That's exactly the way I would like you to play it. Another strength of Russian musical tradition is repertoire, which is carefully chosen and thought through for all ages. Every piece is always a gem, no matter how simple it is. Both in the Russian and Neapolitan music traditions, mentoring of younger pupils by older pupils played a huge role. We all know very well that the best way to learn is to teach. This is why we give our older pupils a chance to work with the younger ones. It is an incredibly inspirational experience for both. Now I'll play that again, that was a bit rushed. So... We give our pupils an opportunity to play together as a group or with professional musicians. It's one of the most enjoyable experiences for them. Something that we do differently to today's practice in Russian music schools is that we encourage children to play more than one instrument if they wish. Playing more than one instrument is incredibly enriching. Being able to compose takes your understanding and music making to a completely different level. This is why we teach it at the school and our pupils are incredibly enthusiastic about it. You might actually want to think where to place it. When was that introduced first in the piece? Uh, where does this go back to? There. Fine. It might be the best place for it, but it might not be. 
Oh, because it's like... Yes, because it introduces yet another note, another harmony to play with. Maybe I could swap them. Like swap these, I'm gonna swap this and that. Yes, and this two part thing has a really good growing potential into growing something like a grand finale. Now yeah, I can do it like this, no, and then sure. later I can like... But if you like it, you can experiment with it. Many of our teachers have flourishing concert careers and have a difficult job of combining teaching at the school with performing worldwide. Public concerts is one of the most important parts of our educational program. It is a pinnacle of the learning process. Many famous musicians and teachers believe that you don't really know a piece of music unless you played it in public. We introduce our pupils to public performances as early as possible so that they could feel like duck in the water on stage and performing in public would always be a very beautiful and emotional experience for them. We have been uh, traveling abroad, playing music in France, we have been playing in Italy, and we have been playing in London. you get from playing in places like that is worth the practice. Before concerts I do get nervous but when I start playing I am in my zone and I imagine myself in the clouds. <laughs> Together we have created at the school a very happy environment in which children are inspired to learn. The London Russian Music School is a lovely place for children and parents alike. And the teachers are all very enthusiastic and the children get along great with each other. It's a really lovely atmosphere here. We like to spend time together as friends and play music, exploring different pieces. We have been very happy in this school. The school, it gives you endless opportunities. The teachers are wonderful. They let you express yourself in every way you want. They're really passionate about what they do. And I think that passion, that infects children. It's the quality, the standards are very, very high.
more than just a music school. We're a huge music family, each member of which is passionate about music and is prepared to work very hard to excel in it. Our work doesn't finish when we finish the lesson. Music really is a way of life for us all. I think there are a lot of music schools in London and some of them are really high quality, but you always feel, and I know I have that experience because my daughter used to go to a traditional British music school, is that they come in, they work for an hour and they go. So with the Russian music school, it's very different. You feel that they really care about your children, they really care about their progress, they really care about their attitude to music, and that is the big difference. This music school represents an extended family for us, not less. For me, music is an important language of interaction and therefore very, very important for me, almost critical that my children learn it so that we have uh, so much more in common, so much more ways to interact and understand each other and experience each other's feelings. I really like this music school because it's a really fun place. This school is just an absolute dream to come to and to wake up every morning to go to. What do you enjoy the most about music? How it calms me down. I enjoy playing for my family. I enjoy the sound of it. I enjoy the emotion. The music is everywhere in this world. I do music because it is very enjoyable and it can project my emotions to other people as if I'm transported to another world. I feel butterflies in my tummy when I sing. Music to me is portraying various emotions in every chord, every note. I find really deep emotions because the music speaks to me. I think it's like a language to communicate with God. The music makes your life so much richer. It inspires me to do better in the world. And whenever I'm playing music, it really it brings me to a place of calm and relax. I can't really imagine life without music because music is everything to me. Music makes me feel happy. Playing makes me feel happy and joyful. I love music. I love music and I love playing it. I just love it so much, it means the world to me. I love music, it's the best thing in the world. It takes my heart to a different place. 